we're gonna cut a piece of thread. So I like to hold the spool of thread in my left hand, grab a piece of thread in my right hand, and just stretch it out as far as your arm will stretch, which shouldn't be that far. You don't want too much thread or it will be hard to sew. And now we're going to pick up our scissors, cut that thread off, keep it in our hands, and we're going to put the spool of thread away. Now a trick is, when you cut your thread, try and cut it on an angle like this. And it just makes it easier to sew. So keep that thread in your hand, grab your needle, I used my right hand to hold the thread, my left hand to hold the needle at this point. We're gonna try and get the thread to that tiny hole in the needle. And this can be the hardest part of sewing, but it will take you a couple tries. Totally worth it. Wow, I just got that through in one shot. That like never happens. I think it's because of that trick, cutting your thread on an angle. So I'm gonna show you that again. There is the hole in the needle. There it is right there. So there's that hole in the needle we wanna get our thread through. So I'm just going to turn it towards the thread, push it through, and we got it. Hole in one. Thread and hole in one. So now, grab your needle with your right hand, gently pull your thread with your left, and you, what you wanna do is make the ends of the thread meet. So just keep pulling it, until they're roughly the same length. So you'll just pull one, pull the other until they're kind of the same length at the bottom. There we go. That's pretty even. Now you wanna smooth the thread a few times with your fingers. Whoops. And if they're not exactly even, that's okay. I'm just going to... Da -da -da. Pull this one down, and now they're even. There we go. So now grab your needle, run your fingers down the thread. Think about love and happiness and how awesome whatever you sew is gonna be. This just makes the thread have good vibes, first of all. Second of all, some of the oil on your fingers will make that thread nice and smooth. So this is a really nice ritual to do before you start sewing. Speaking of starting sewing, we are ready to do that right now. So once you have your threaded needle, don't let it go. If you have to let it go, then just put it back in your cork. 